the greatness is not achieved through the worldly gain but the greatness is achieved by giving oneself to others dear brothers and sisters in jesus christ we are in the tuesday of the seventh week of ordinary time and today we reflect on the gospel of saint mark chapter 9 verses 30 to 37 and in today's gospel we see the disciples were arguing on their way who is the greatest jesus knew that one he kept silent once they are at a home Jesus asked the disciples what were you arguing about they kept silent and Jesus told them the way to be greatest is not the way the world sees the world thing the greatest person is the one who is the greatest achiever in material ways name fame power pleasure wealth all those things but what jesus is saying if you want to be the greatest you should be the lowest the least among all of you and if you want to be the greatest you should be the servant for all of you means the greatness is not achieved through the worldly gain but the greatness is achieved by giving oneself to others how much you are able to self sacrifice and give it to others for their well being that much you become greatest you look in the world any person who is admired and honored in the centuries to come they are the people who self sacrificed for the country or for the society and again jesus is telling you how to be like a child not being a childish but to have the qualities of a child child like a child is always dependent on the mother or the family the child is not independent child is always dependent in the same way we should be able to dependent on god in every decision making in everything what we do in our life we should be able to be dependent on god so when we are fully dependent on god actually what happen we receive jesus in our life as st paul says no more i who live but christ lives in me so i become another christ and this is saying god the father will accept that person because he accepted me in his life so my dear friends we are called to serve and to manifest christ in our day to day lives